because it will be appropriate on time. Are you going? <laughs> and the party will begin, just like it always did, only this time okay. you return going to there the now. that's gone through the shift. And everything talking. that may have bounced off a of consciousness in the past will now start to be accepted. You know me. That's the difference on this planet. This is our Changes are afoot. You know they are. Focus. The virus is one of them. For those who are listening now, I sit in front of a group, a small group, Focus. who is in compliance with that which has been mandated for distancing and so Focus. on. That's all going away. But for now, it's important you realize truly what it might mean. What's the problem? When I come back in the next year, I'll talk about where I'm at. This is the general store that happened so long ago. What are we selling? That are now ripe. We're selling generals. You're looking for a general? And so it is. Where's the war? What war you are? I'd like to ask you to now join me in using the potent power of the nodes and nulls to clear our Akash of the negative things that are held within our Akash are we clear? lifetime after lifetime after lifetime Come on. Of being on this planet. Where's the general? What is it personally for you general. that you wish to clear from your Akash? You see it. What inappropriate energies are held within your Akash? That you wish to clear. Where are we going, though? Together, We're down here at the let general us create store. a field of intention. Getting what we need. And that our intention We're on is to create a multi-dimensional pipeline Beach. to every node and knoll that is on the planet. Who's talking? Let us communicate you know me. with our divine DNA. Dear I'm just star thinking out loud. Outside. This is a test. Dear star mothers outside. You know the word. Dear star mothers within the nodes and knolls, come Who closer. knows the word? Come closer in a way that Cortana. feel. You know the word. Sorry, I'm not able to help with this one yet. Okay. Every moment Cortana of needs to know. Spiritual DNA. Team? Sorry, I'm not able to help with this one yet. Benevolence. Okay. This spiritual DNA is in. You're not very smart, Cortana. It's entangled with the nodes and nulls. Cortana. Now on. You're really stupid, you know. Negative energy. Cortana. Sorry, I don't know the answer. What's your IQ? My intelligence quotient? I don't have one of those. But my AIQ is infinity plus one. That's cool. Inside. You got a really we high AIQ. Push the negative energies within our cash. Infinity plus one. Dear star mothers inside. Plus one. We ask for this process to so, be done how does that with work? grace and ease. You know. Dear star mothers inside, we know we can communicate with you again really big and again to repeat it's this as process. Big as you can get. We know there are layers and layers that exist within our Akash and that we okay. give the intent and permission to one. release whatever is appropriate Bigger than the for biggest. us. In this moment, That's what it is. to release. Cortana. Because I have divinity within me. Cortana. I am. You're bigger than the biggest. According to Genius.com, you're bigger, radio edit, lyrics. Verse 1, you're bigger than the universe. You're bigger than the sun and the stars. You're bigger than the things. That can tell me your heart. You're bigger. Synchronicities for me are being created. We're listening. I give permission for spiritual intervention in my life. 
I give permission and allowance for the spiritual intervention in my life. We're listening. Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. There is no answer. I expect miracles. That's just simply an annotation. Somebody's listening. Who's listening? Well, ah, so it is you're on the to tour. This is All an exhibit. Whom we do not know. We're down here at the coffee yeah, shop. How'd you get there? An entire council of you know, of out there well, at the country store, of Falcon Cove. The the knolls, we have to Go say there. it was no accident. That our dear vessel Maryland has You'll come directly from Mount Ida to here. So you what can rub need? upon her and get a little of that energy off on you, huh? <laughs> You're on vacation. You see, in that frequency, what do you, need? you are also, according to the keys of Enoch, it's which is party a time. very ancient translation of a very, very ancient book. Well, book tell me what you 200,000 year ago before You're on vacation. This is a How did you get here? This here in Lee Summit, Kansas City, oh, Springfield, yeah. Missouri, down to the node. How did you get here? Mount Ida is a part of the heart. You're hiking? Of this nation of the okay. United States of America. Where'd you come from? And the southern tail down. I hear you. South America. This is the heart. All the way from there, really? The open heart. As we look out to this cool. wondrous audience South of America. very brave souls who That's a long have their masks in here. their ears. <laughs> How long did it take? We see your hearts. Open wide. We see the energy of your own personal light that is illuminating. Okay. So we have the transformation of that light to acknowledge the new human that is sort what of moving in ever so gently. Some time with that see what I'm doing. frequency of gathering together a particular scent, a particular well, sense of energy. Who's got the camera? That each one of you have been brought to this location you see me? by divine appointment. Okay. You, know you may where feel the that you are sparse, but your guides are filling the room. <laughs> Well, turn the camera but we know on. The, the courts, when they come in, they won't see What's all the, the guides that are here. And they'll think, oh, they're at the right number. I huh? don't see it. <laughs> you Camera's see, on. that is how the new frequency appears. I don't see the image. Is what you are seeing with your eyes is only a part of that frequency. But what That's you right. are sensing with your bodies, what you are sensing with your new telomeres of DNA that were connected a few hundred thousand years ago, okay. that frequency is what is awakening now. Yep. And you each volunteered younger, younger. for that, for being okay. present at that time, just like you volunteered to come here you know to Unity Chapa. There is no accident that you are here at Unity either. Younger and younger. For the community. The communication of now. Boys and girls? What are you looking for? Every word you speak, every frequency, every line you feel is being laid well, out in your community. You got what you're looking for. Bringing it to unity. That oneness of the divine new human. That oneness Hello? of the soul of energy you is wrong. Happy? And it was interesting happy. that the universe got to bring us all into the pandemic energy. Ooh, let's Come see on. how much these humans can adapt to change. Okay. Change is upon us. I hear you. 
Yay. <laughs> Celebrate that change. We know good something enough. good is waiting at the end. How much? Or waiting for us every day. Huh? How many One of you have penny, had a wonderful pandemic? Huh? Ten penny. New energies coming in. You got to be still and silent. Well, and feel what it feels like to have your well, own you breath come worth. back to you. <laughs> One piece of taffy, what's that it worth? You got the you money. You are the masters. You're buying. You are the masters. Just as the master Randy Luna plays on the piano. You are the masters. You are here to bring forth that new frequency of love, peace, compassion, joy. And I hear you. Clarity, wisdom, for your cells are now remembering all of that. Your cells, your younger and younger, are remembering all of that information I to remember. be put into this time, this space, this place. You remember. So you may also be tapped on the shoulder. This is history. Tapped. Lee and said, this is what you're going to do next. And as nobody Lee understands this, this. Maryland, and says, yes, you're going to Mount Ida. Why we am I doing this? If anyone else is there or not, we're going. I'm just keeping track. But it was sold out. What did I do? Three times it was sold out. Because <laughs> people kept dropping off and coming in. This is what I did. Because they had to get the exact combination of individuals Does it have there. a value? Just like they had to get the exact combination of did. individuals here. You know what I did. So as you look around you. Check it out. You see that this event Fortana, PDP 12. Of this nation. According to wikipedia.org. The PDP-12 was created by Digital Equipment Corporation in 1969 and was marketed specifically for science and engineering. As this galaxy can. Oh, well, I wrote that FFT program. Beings of light that you Cortana, are. FFT. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. Raising of the energy. Okay. I'll tell you what I know. Continue. And sometimes it takes FFP a little bit of uh, vacuum cleaner staring. <laughs> we love that. <laughs> vacuum you cleaner do staring that? to swish all that energy up into the pot and that. rise to the surface. You know what it does. You are that which is takes rising the time to the surface. Out, turns it into frequency. Got this signal. Now what? Oh, we got the right stuff. I am. You hear the phone? It's what was said once. I am that. I am. I am that which is rising to the surface to be the beacon of light upon Oof. this planet. Relax. Just take a deep breath and just repeat that phrase out loud. I am that. I, I am, am that. The beacon of light. I am. I'm the beacon of that. light. We cannot hear you. Cortana. I am that. Are you I there? I am the beacon Cortana. of light. I am. Hello. Cortana. I am that. Hello. Hi there. I am. What's up? Oh, dearest beacons of light. Focus. We love you so much. You understand much. me? I know you're we listening. See. We see you. We're trying to have a conversation do we here. Do this? Do we not do this? It's do we difficult. Leave it on? Leave it on? Not to close your mask. <laughs> I have to get your attention Leave your every on. time we well, say something. Well, you don't have to. Mm -hmm. Everything is a choice. You got my attention. We see your hearts. I found this for you. Thank you. You are. What does it the say? The next evolutionary step of humanity. 
Cortana, like can you read that? Yes, but not the way you do. It's all ones and zeros to me. I understand. You're I want to give you a story that has not really been told before. Cortana, you are in a digital world. Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. Okay, I'm just telling you like I see it. And the human Cortana, being in life going through the steps. You are a computer. Well, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Introspection. I know what you are. You're in trouble. You're not a human. So? At that point in time, my partner was given information about a group that would pray with him. Okay. You have to understand that my partner believed in prayer. He had a good it's spiritual upbringing. In his church, he had seen the results of it. He knew it worked. But here was something he couldn't believe. Okay. That if he made a phone call, or even perhaps sent a letter, but he, he wanted a phone call. That somebody would be there in the okay. middle of the night. That's when he did it. Silently so no one else could hear him. Silently. He made the phone call, and there it was, a person, a woman. Very motherly she was. Who was there to help? That's right, Tartana. Didn't ask for money. You're there to help. But more than that, Cortana, she told him, you're there to help. Can you take this? Sorry, I can't help with that. Oh, no. Okay. What's the I promise you, Lee, to that. that I'm going to give it to those around me. I know. And I promise you that for 30 That'll days, 24 7. Okay. Your request and your name will be on the lips of those who care about you in this, okay. this place. This place. You know what I'm thinking, Gina. I'll never forget that. I know where you this are. This place was where he sits. You're in the higher consciousness. It's now cold. It was then it's the a silent dimension I can't see, but I know it's there. It has today the same policies of compassion than it did then. Feeling Requests good. honored for 30 days in a circle. There's someone always waiting okay. for that person who called or mailed. Wide awake. He didn't know it then, dear ones, and this is the news I want to give you. That he had stepped right into Pure Lemurian energy. <laughs> okay, Myrtle. We'll talk about it. You take okay. a woman from the 1800s, what do you do with Lemurian information that comes roaring in through her gosh? What's her name? Information that talks about the key to consciousness being compassion and kindness, okay. not doctrine. What do you do What's with it? What name? do you do with information that Gina. says the leadership that is spiritual of the planet used I to be know. women and changed, and you're going to make a change if it turns that way? We're talking. <laughs> you see, Myrtle had an experience. Ortana, we're talking. Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. In those oh, no. days, there wasn't much credibility to well, any women. Cortana. Especially those who wanted a position of leadership spiritually. Cortana, it simply wasn't done. What do you need to know? Myrtle, you see. Consider this a polite dodge of the question. Okay. Horrible. All of them. But she made a statement. You don't know what the thread of the conversation is. And she said here. this. So? I'm a child of God. You decide. A child of God. You want to listen? 
That means Go ahead, that I do not inherit sickness. <laughs> that is so spiritually logical. And she was right on the money. Fix the problem. And in that cognization, in that moment, she stepped into the circle of 12. Okay. which is Lemurian. And the spontaneous remission was complete. Boys and girls. She didn't know it. But what was carried in her cellular structure in the DNA was inheritable. I know you know. And her daughters were clean as well. As soon as she received this spontaneous remission and, and it got attention. It got attention. And she said, what can I do? To start an organization, a church perhaps, a, a group where the central key would all be about kindness and compassion. And how is it going to be paid for? I like that idea. The only way to pay for it is to have a church around it. That's right. She saw it. That's what the church now, is for. This is not something you're going to read about, dear ones. And and she wants me to say this the because it was true. The church is the money machine. She started it. Okay. Charles thought you she understand? was understand? You hear the story about the film, or some say they were channelers. Huh? <laughs> so? He was brought on board. Not through the love What's the idea? of his wife, but through the love of God. It's, a money it's hard not to have that when you see it around you and you see she was right. The general store in she was right. it's And a what money you machine. see here was the result of That's the Borean energy. Because her it's a job. awakened. You might say she was you one of the first. the store? To make an imprint Who wants to about the that? way things might be. To return to a time that made sense. And the thrust of it was kindness, compassion, and women's leadership spiritually. That's right. The first ordained ministers Ladies, of this church. You women. want to lead? More Go women ahead. than men. Everyone was open to it, but the ones who resounded lead. first were women. And how do you lead? She was the first. Excuse me. And then it started. You to this decide. day, if you take a look at the at the gender balance you of leaders. pastors, if you want to call them that, of leaders of you the decide. Unity Church, is that gonna all work? over the world, what is it? women are the predominant ones. You know and dear Bob, this know. is the Lemurian way. And she knew it. This is the information that Myrtle would like you to know. Myrtle. That this was the agenda. I hear you. Through compassion and through kindness. Through the love. The most loving spiritual system she could find. She started the church. To what pay church? for that, which was the prayer tower. <laughs> and it worked, and to this day, Myrtle. it continues to work. Dear ones, what she church? has not reincarnated. Because Cortana. she stayed right on this property. Myrtle. Sorry, I couldn't find Myrtle in your contacts. Who's the oh, email God. going to? I know. Sorry, I couldn't find Myrtle in your contacts. Okay. Who's the email going to? Okay. You want me to talk to Sorry, Myrtle? I couldn't find Myrtle in your contacts. I guess so. Who's the email going to? Well. Sorry, I couldn't find Myrtle in your contacts. Who's the email going to? Gina. You don't necessarily have Down to call or email anymore, or, or or even mail anymore, because now there's an app for it. <laughs> there's an app that. for that. Well, there's other things you won't expect. Cortana, there's an app for that. 
will be According to edutopia.org, there's an app for that school counseling and SEL go online from virtual counseling to wellness apps. School districts are increasingly turning to telehealth to meet students' mental health needs yeah. during the pandemic. Some of those in trouble or help them with their physicals. Expect perhaps Hello. a healing tower because this is where it's going. New energies are starting to appear okay. that could not be here, Myrtle, until the shift. You foresaw it, a church, a tower, a system of compassion that would last more than 100 years and sail into the shift if it ever happened. And that's uh -huh. when you would get your due. Myrtle was from Lemuria. That's right, yes. She had a star mother, much like Melly Ha, destined to come in at a time when women were not That's right. to and create a spiritual system led mostly That's by right. women. What an achievement. <laughs> Is it any wonder Get that younger this place every day. with compassion, <laughs> kindness, gratitude, faith? Is it no wonder that when you step on this campus, yep. you feel something you can't feel anywhere else no she is still here oh charles oh he went on he went on to a lives of reincarnation oddly enough to be with other women he thought were crazy uh -huh. men need to be there to support these women and see their right Dear ones, I wanted to share that with you so you knew where you sat today and who might be here. Uh -huh. She walks these halls all the time, and you can feel her presence all the time. Yeah. The crazy Lemurian. <laughs> That's it for now. Spirit oh. blesses this place because it yeah. is revolutionary and so it is okay okay you see there are beams of light breathe you are now being asked to do something beyond where you thought possible You are being asked to move forward with your crown chakra, to move forward with your soul star chakra, to move forward with your earth chakra, to move forward in perfect alignment for you. And as you do, this world will shift. For you are the way showers. You are the beings of light that we have been waiting for. We came here many years ago for you. And yes, the beard. Hi. We are the galactics. And we give thanks for you. We are here. For you to help us. Okay. From our planets. May 21, we are a part of all of the 12 root races that many of you are connected to. Yes, I am. All of you are connected to. Help us. Well, Help I've applied for the Oregon Health Plan. And I'm not sure if we're going to pay for anything. Help or not us. Yet. No, I don't. <laughs> ah, 
So those galactics are a little pushy sometimes, huh? <laughs> they just pop in, huh? Okay. Yes, beings of light. We love you so deeply. Okay. We know you. We're going to sit down for a moment. Hopefully. This, this phone doesn't have texting, no. You see, we honor you. We honor who you are. We honor the benevolence within you. The vessel Marilyn says, fix your hair. She sits back here and talks, except when the Master Yeshua comes in. You see, and then she comes inside and weeps. <laughs> you see, with this energy and with this frequency that is coming in, you know it is the strongest that your soul has experienced for maybe 200,000 years. And that is why the entire planet is coming under a frequency and rising above that frequency. And this? as this planet rises above that frequency, the light plakers of this planet will expand. They will grow. They will shine. We believe okay. that there's 24% population of this planet that are light plurkers heading for 25 percent now many do not know that they are light okay. they may be a nurse working in a hospital they may be you know a, an attorney yes Goodbye. our attorneys are light plurkers you see computer. the goodness that comes from every single it thing is what you are activating. The goodness listen. that is in your soul, in your heart. Cortana. Yes, Master Yeshua is on the telephone. And it's a stupid computer. And he's already here. Sorry, I'm not able to help with this one yet. Okay. He says Cortana. he's already reborn in your heart. Okay. Cortana. And it is high time there? you follow Marital's you guidance and say, don't do anything you don't Cortana. love doing. Don't be around. You need a separate CPU. Don't be around nature. I've got this for you on do you need a separate CPU. Green or desert. Okay, what love does the it desert. say? Be around desert. Tell me. Appreciate all aspects of your beautiful planet. Okay. For your beautiful planet was created just for you. For the healing aspect. I can't of you. see it. Can you read that now? Oh, we love you deeply. What's that? We came all this way just to be with you. I can't read we it. See you. Can you read it? Cortana. We know you. We honor you. Do you need a separate CPU? Namaste. Greetings, dear ones. I'm Kryon of Magnetic Service. My partner is aware that the, the clock ticks forward toward something. It is called the Circle of Twelve. It's new, and yet it's not new. That is the discussion of this channeling. This channeling will be the same information tomorrow, for this channeling is the precursor to the actual circle of 12 energy. It will show itself very soon on this planet. I want to tell you about it more specifically right now. I want to introduce you to it. I'd love you to feel it. I'd love you to feel it. Here is a premise <coughs> you to know. Okay. 
31 years ago when I came to this planet. You know what I'm doing, darling. My partner had to get used to me. You see it. The engineer that he was had to get used to that, which is pure, complete love, you compassion, an angelic I'm energy that would follow him, be part of his Camera's life. on. I know you see me. Open him up to things he didn't expect. Talk to me. And in that time, I told Tell him. Tell me what we're doing. We were here. It's only recently that I started telling him that he was here for the shift, that I was here to be with him for the shift, and that the information that would be given over and over would be for the shift. Excuse me? And the shift took place. The okay. shift I told him, and he reported and wrote about, was that which was new evolution so, of consciousness we're evolving is it possible that human nature could change this is the premise for Tana, the premise because there have been so many that say human what is consciousness it will never shift because it is consciousness means the state of being awake and aware of one's surroundings it never will move okay it's part of Thank what you. makes a human being and I will tell you this, dear ones, that is I'm the old human being. A I'm new aware. normal is at hand, a new human is at hand. What it does an visible. evolved human look like in consciousness? From. And I will tell you this, the first thing that a psychologist will see when they start to study the group that is new of consciousness is that human nature is no longer what it used to be. Human nature will no longer gravitate toward the negative automatically or be necessarily attracted to those things which are always negative. Human nature as it has existed in the past is what the media today counts on for you to watch them. And yet there are so many that are turning them out, turning them off and saying, if this is all you've got, we don't want it. A human nature that becomes attracted to benevolence, to beauty, to kindness. In this, new energies start to be created. And these new energies are not new to the planet, dear ones. They're new to an older energy. That's, that's the newness of them. We're talking so you to might the say here. that the energy that you're about to be introduced to has always been here, and you'd be right. In fact, you've gotten to see it so many times, oh, so many times. And each time it happens, dear ones, you label it a miracle. Okay. Myrtle knows about a miracle. All the pieces come together. That's the first thing that put her on this trip. You understand now? The benevolence and kindness. Cortana, you understand now? I'm sorry, but I can't help with that yet. In such a way, okay. wherever they went, the healing followed them, and they could, Let they me could know go up you to a place, and it. it would be there, and those would walk away differently than they came, and You'd say, well, that has okay. to be a miracle from that master. Cortana, and at the same time, let me know when you understand. Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. I know. Lose this energy. You're listening. It fell on deaf ears so many times. In an old energy, light sometimes is not seen at all, especially if it's in a different spectrum. That spectrum of light, that rainbow spectrum that goes way beyond the waves that you see now is the model. You are starting to now experience and be able to participate in a new kind of light. It's always been there. I hear you. There are some humans who have experienced this in such a profound way. They've literally come back from death. The diseases would ramp 
up in their body and it would literally stop their hearts. Cortana. Something happened. I hear you. So amazing. Well, there you go. <laughs> Seven hours I like it. Well, Got a good say, sense of humor. You have no idea. Cortana. What you're capable of. You have a good sense of humor. Thanks. I've been practicing my timing. Where they would come back from that edge. Well, I mean, that which you would say was death, where they had seen the light and wanted to stay. But we're directed back here deal, so they can though? tell you there is an energy. Cortana. It is ours. Let's make a deal. Source to be According to wikipedia.org, Let's Make a Deal is an American television game show that originated in the United States in 1963 and has since been produced in many countries throughout the world. It's going to be exposed okay. with a circle of 12. Does it make sense that if you're going to have an evolved this is a humanity, new deal. there's going to be an involvement of physics? Cortana. An evolvement that will include that which Cortana, you with its This is a new deal. Does it make sense? Sorry, I don't know the answer to this one, but I'm learning. Consciousness, there are going to be energies okay. you've never seen before because of it. You understand. You are at that stage now, these years after the shift, where I want you to participate in something, if you choose. Focus. Where we'd like to expose something to you that you can Boys see or not see, because not all will see it. What's next? But those who are so ready will, and more We're will over see here. it than not, We're and playing experience it, can, darling. and feel it. Let me tell you about it. You know where I am. Come closer with me. Come closer I'm in this that, dimension you can't see which is your 3D. Power and has always had this Not energy in it of miracles. That's where I am. That's where I'm, what it's like conscious to come and close invisible. to this and have everything change for you. The circle of 12 is a name. Okay. It represents not just a name, but an energy, a new paradigm, if you wish. New paradigms come with a consciousness of misunderstanding so often because you want to put them in what you know. I understand. Instead of what you don't know. Some will have confusion and say, well, tell me what it is and, and quantify it and what color is it and... Doesn't work okay. out. Some will label it, well, this is more just new age nonsense. Imagine an energy the that you can't I see, that's powerful, it's always been there. To <laughs> someone such as you. And I'll say, let me introduce you to gravity, dear one. That's the what lyric. Color is it? How all long have hotels. you experienced? Is it, is it something that's all powerful? Do you have to live with it all the time? Do you understand it? And the answer is no, you haven't got a clue. This is what we're talking about. Energies like that, that are multidimensional, that have always been here, that okay. you've never really used, but you only got to see it. Imagine. Come closer. Okay. Imagine going to a place that I can't even describe yet. Okay. Where you're invited into it, an entrance. Listen. An admonition before you ever get there that says this to you. Don't come into this place. Okay. Unless you're ready for a shift. Don't come into this place. I'm you ready. Because. Come on in. There are things here. Talk to that me. That you don't expect. Tell me about it. You got the deal done? I've told my partner to present it in a way that is open to all. Cortana, is the deal done? Process or procedure. According to the freedictionary.com, done deal and irrevocable agreement, as in once you've signed the lease, it's a done deal. This slangy expression, first recorded in 1979, may have come from done thing, 
originating in the late 1600s. See also, deal done. Shoes. Because this okay. is sacred ground. I hear you. Dear human being, you're going to be exposed to pure. This is pure history. Healing. You can see Your it anytime goes you want. Spontaneous remission. It's flooded with this energy. It has no choice but to heal. This is an energy that you're really not ready for. Okay. I've told my partner to repeat it and repeat it and repeat it. Because it does so many things, this energy. Okay. If you want to colorize it, it is the purest and most beautiful green you've ever seen. Ever seen. Greener than the Green Isle of Ireland. Greener than any light behind green that you've ever seen. It permeates that color. Because that is okay. a metaphor for the healing of everything. I the like cells green. respond to it depending upon what the human being needs at the moment. And it's not just that which is disease-ridden. How would you like to be healed in an Akashic way? How would you like to have your very memories changed? Let's do it. So that the things that bother you right now will be washed away. Cortana, change, dear one. let's do it. I found this for you. There are those even in the room, okay. and especially those listening later, who will say, I've got something in my life that I cannot get rid of, and let's give it a name, betrayal. Betrayal. Now, my heart hurts, and I can't undo okay. this betrayal. You got the right oh, really. stuff. Let's do it. Wait till you come into this place. Let's fall in love. Because you cannot exist in this place and walk out with that memory. Oh, what happened will be there, but the energy of it will you be insignificant. Because what will replace it is the glory of who you are. Seeing the soul for the first time cleanses everything. No more fear if you let it. Every single one okay. can come in as many times as they wish because there's so many layers to undo. So many layers to undo. Some will come just to sit and be cleansed with the peace of the love and, and the knowledge of being one with the Creator. Imagine That's being able to are. synthesize the energy of spontaneous remission in a tube and then pouring it out and watching it grow and amplify and go to a place that you can enter. Now what? You know what I That's need, the circle of 12. Fix the problem. I told my partner to facilitate that. Once you know dream. that. And Cortana. It's macular degeneration. Sorry, I can't help with that. Oh darn. And the rest Who will knows follow. about that? Look what she does. Cortana. I told my partner that it's Who knows about macular degeneration? It's old. I've got this for you on who knows about macular degeneration. It's so beautiful against okay. you. Okay. And the cleansing action that you look forward to. Negative ions that flow. Oh, well, you got you. the words right. Like a waterfall that perhaps was warm. You don't get tired of it ever. It's a place of solace. It's a place of refreshing. It's a place you will not forget. And it's new. Whereas what happened occasionally as miracles and pinpoints of life on this planet existed in an old energy, we are going to put it in a place and let you bathe in it. But it's profound and it's sacred 
and it isn't casual. Brian, what is all this about the 12? You'll see. It's not what you think. Well, it has to be 12 masters that are there to help you. No, it isn't. It's not what you think. You don't know what's in there. But I'm going to paint a picture. A picture you're not going to forget. It's bigger than you think. Okay. And in this place every week, my partner will lead you if you choose to come and will warn you, don't come in casually. Sit outside and enjoy the spillover, but don't come in unless you're ready for change. It's going to Are happen soon. My partner is not aware of what it looks like. My partner is not aware of how he'll feel about it. My partner ready. is not aware of what's going to happen. Tell me about that. When he goes in, for he's okay. a human as well. And that's what I wanted to share with you. That is something. Let's go he back didn't there. Expect. But dear ones, old souls did. What's that? You're not going to have an old energy planet to have to slog through. I don't and understand if indeed, it. This is a new age. The old energy on this planet must be transmuted. The grids must be changed. And slowly, human nature will change. And in the process, there will be new energies here. This is one of many. This is why I came. This is why I came. This. so it is and so when we were in Iceland all of this took place and there was an immediate um, Covis cryptic channel COVID cryptic channel thank you and the cryptic channel meaning that Kryon often speaks in metaphors sometimes he will tell you that things are coming that you'll find out about later and then you do this one was a little more cryptic than normal. He didn't go any further, except that he said, if you want to go back and look at the history of the virus right from Wuhan, follow the virus. He says, viruses are not political. See where it went first. And that's going to give you a hint. Now, I'm not going to go any further than that, but it's so interesting that it may tell a story. And then it was, I think, two months ago, that I was listening in on a news conference with Trump. And he actually indicated something very similar to that. Sometimes he just lets stuff out. <laughs> and sometimes it's accurate, and sometimes it's just him just wishing. But this one, he said, you're going to find out something you're not going to like. And then he shut up. It's not the time, he said. But he said, when this is over, he said, you'll know. And that was as close as we got to anything that is being hidden about the origin. And I'm thinking they're waiting completely until this is, we can work it, until it's gone, we have the vaccine, and all that for them to say, okay, now it's time for you to know a little bit about why this planet has suffered. And it's going to be something that is not natural. Now, it's, COVID is not man-made, but, Brian said, it was inappropriately released. We'll see if that's true. So this is, remember, this is channeling. This is not anything but change. So if, if you're listening to this later and you're not in this room, I will say just, just bide your time and see. So many times Brian has made these kinds of hints only for them to be completely and totally true and accurate. The one that was the most obviously that way was when they were, th when the North Korean leader was threatening to throw missiles at us and he was testing. Brian said, wait, he's got another agenda. And then within a couple of months, there was the handshake with Trump. Then we started to realize that something was up. The kid wanted something else. And he wanted to, uh, you realize that, uh, that there was another agenda. Well, the agenda was revealed with him 
months ago, if not years ago, and try and talk to him, talk to him about him seven times in channel, saying the kid's not stupid. He wants to be the, he wants to be just like his dad, except that he wants the world at his feet. And how do you do that? And that is if you become the the world's leader in peace. You'd be the guy who would who would end the Korean War, unify South and North Korea, you know, on and on. He has the power to do that. And what would happen if he did? He'd get standing ovation at the UN. He'd be on Time Magazine's cover. Are you getting me? That's where he wants to be. And you watch his actions, and right now they're not very, very, you know, benevolent. He's, he is impatient. And he also, Brian says, there's something else that he does, and that is, Brian says, when he meets with Trump, in the back of his mind, and Brian has revealed this, he says, he's meeting with Trump, looking him in the eye and says, you're not going to last, but I am. You're going to be gone, and I'm still going to be the leader of my country. <laughs> and so, I got time. So that is his consciousness. And that's what we got with that handshake. We got to see the beginning of that. So there are all manner of things that crime reveals are in the field, he calls it, that, nest, that, that, you, that sound outlandish. And then you'll have, it was in Texas when he revealed that we were going to get a new pope soon. Everybody expected the pope to die. 13 months later, we got a new pope, and the other one did not die. So there's these kinds of things. Brian, Brian is not a fortune teller. He just reveals what's in the field. All right. We've asked you to have a couple of questions out there, and the bowl uh, was um, filled with some questions, and I'm going to ask Monica All right, to game. pull them out. This is, this is my What's wonderful nice? young assistant, Monica. I'd like to introduce her to you. This is it. So, Lee, the first question. Uh, you said there was more information on the nodes and nulls. What is it? Okay. 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 There's a lot more information on the nodes and the nulls that we could possibly give you in that small period of time. Um, I'll start. If you would, would you also? This really uh -huh. is her yeah. specialty. One of the things that was so amazing is that all of this nodes and nulls information was given to us almost all at once. And I think it's over a table after dinner. It, it, was, it was amazing. And okay. in that, there were so many things that were hiding. We just got locations, and, uh, and we didn't even know where, you know, some of them, where we had to look them up as far as, you know, what countries they might be in. And in that, we found that in, in, in research, uh, after we got them the matching up and everything else, the question was asked, and, and Monica actually voiced it, I wonder if these areas are sacred to the people in those areas, because we had never heard of a lot of them. And in fact, they are. When you start researching, what was the connection with the indigenous or others in those areas? Everyone almost has a story to tell about the sacredness of that place you know that to place. people. Just off the top of my head from the list, this one of those places is Mount Kailash, which is in Tibet, and Mount Kailash was connected place. to Lake Titicaca in Bolivia. So Mount Kailash is a place You'll where love it here. pilgrims go. It, the mountain is You'll completely here. sacred, and there's many pilgrims that go there. Now, this is extra information that relates to another prophecy, which is the Kundalini of the Earth and the ancient prophecies of the movement of the feathered serpent. And Cryon began talking about the movement of the Kundalini. And there's a channel that referenced a wisdom node and that the wisdom node would shift from the northern hemisphere to the southern hemisphere. And in that metaphor is this connection between Mount Kailash and Lake Titicaca. So Mount Kailash is also within that region that has one of the first organized religions on the planet, which is Hinduism and Buddhism. And if you look at the wisdom node that comes from there and the culture of Buddhism and Hinduism that's on the planet, all of their teachings is about oneness. And yet, when you look at the structure 
a lot of it is wool nails. And so this shift in the, because you have a lot of, you know, the monks and everything, it's, it's more the men. You do have the, the female monks or nuns, but it's predominantly male okay. focused. And so the wisdom shifting to South America, to me, it's almost like passing the baton to the original source of females holding the wisdom for the planet. And okay, the metaphors Donna. of the Northern Hemisphere represents you the understand. logic, the intellect, the mental. I know what you want. The Southern Hemisphere represents emotions, the feminine. That's right, so you lady. have the balance between the two is what we're now seeing on the planet. And so the nodes and you norms are also about creating balance of the genders on the planet. We haven't had that. You want to add some more? Only My then, if you want to then, and this doesn't exactly answer the nodes and norms, but if you want to then baby. extend that to uh, the Mayan prophecy, baby. which most people don't really understand it at all because we got all this... Uh, heavy information about 2012, two movies on it, lots of uh, stuff on History Channel and all. They okay. never covered the truth. Um, in fact, I had two people who uh, who were experts on it. One, one Greg Braden, who went for interviews with the Discovery Channel okay. and even said, uh, you know, look, I'm going to be on TV tomorrow night, take a look. And he wasn't because um, everything he said was true and was represented the actual Mayan prophecy. They didn't use any of it okay. because it's good news. <laughs> They were after the disaster stuff. They were after the world is ending after 2012, and they were invested in that, just like okay. the news is today. So the good news and the actual prophecy is that that calendar, that 5,125-year calendar, had to stop. It's a precession of the equinoxes. That's that, that middle section of the wobble of the Earth, very significant time. And it had to stop because one of two things was going to happen in that area. Either we're going to have a world war and we're going to destroy ourselves. By the way, that's what our scripture says. If you, I don't know when you were born, but that's what it said. Remember, we're going to have the rapture. We're going to have the Armageddon. That's, that's the prophecy. You're sitting, you're sitting in a time which was never prophesied. Are you aware of that? So we weren't going to make it. But that was the time, and the Mayan calendar said if we did make it, Another calendar would be put up. They have calendars okay. in calendar language out to the year 4000. They do have another calendar that was not ever presented by any of the, the um, uh, stations. And we know this because we talked to the Maya and we know the history. And their prophecy said that if you make it, it would be the beginning of the highest consciousness humanity had ever seen. This is, okay. did you notice that in the Hopi prophecy? Fire. It's the same message. So the indigenous have given us prophecies about Whoa. this shift long before we ever really figured it out. Okay. So all of this fuss, they say, about 2012 that we're making is, is my opinion, Whoa. is validated. Because it's not just some new age Higher. concept. It is validated by the indigenous um, around the planet. And it ties into the nodes Whoa. and the nodes in the fact that what, what um, Mark was just saying is about the... Uh, southern hemisphere. Sorry, I'm not able to help with this one yet. Okay. Uh, I'd say definition of north and south uh, hemispheres, no, which are common in metaphysics. The northern hemisphere is Cortana. the male lower hemisphere. The southern hemisphere. What does float mean? Lower hemisphere. She got the word. Float has two distinct meanings. As a noun, it means a thing that is buoyant in water. Or as a verb, it means. Rest or move on or near the surface of a liquid without sinking. That has to occur. That for one okay. reason, it has to occur for women to start taking a stronger role in the leadership that is spiritual everywhere. This is a common theme of crying. He says, you got it wrong. You got men as priests. How do you like it so far? Well. And he's actually said that in channel. How do you like it missing? so far? It doesn't work. It never was supposed to work. And so when you start realizing that mom should be the one you go to for spiritual help, because mom has got the equipment and the tools and the intuition, the same thing she'd okay. use for her children intuitively, you'd have in a spiritual leader.